in Kentucky, this was undoubtedly the first place in the United States that grew grapes. Back in the late 1700s, the first commercial vineyard and winery was actually started in Jessamine County, Kentucky. And at the time of Prohibition, Kentucky was the third largest state when it came to uh, grape production and wine production. The nice thing about Kentucky is we have um, a nice kind of sweet spot here with regard to our climate during the summer months that are critical for ripening grapes. Kentucky is, has a good growing season, good climate for growing grapes if you, if you do it properly, if you manage disease and the pests and those kinds of things. And you can grow some excellent varieties of grapes here that make excellent wines. Everything that I hear is a positive growth. And, uh, and why not? We have a good climate. We have wonderful soil. It's a matter of choosing the type of varietals that will help us produce um, a distinguishing wine. So in our particular case, it's a combination of the, the soil, the type soil we have, uh, the terrain, the lay of the land, the hills, with the breeze that we get up here, and it just makes a great place for, uh, for wine grapes. Obviously, the, the new varieties of grapes grow well here and you really can make good wine from it. I would want anyone to come into the state and give it sort of an open-minded try. Because some people think, oh, you can't make good wine in Kentucky. You know, California is the only wine state in the nation, apparently. So I want people to know that Kentucky can make really good wine. And in a lot of ways, I think it's better than California wine. This year, you take pick any grape and, and you'll taste how sweet and wonderful and full it is. And that's because of the vines. They are really starting to mature and able to develop the, the grape.